Good morning students, this is the class for 8th standard science subject and physics or first lesson is measurement, okay. Already we have learnt about the measurement in our 6th standard class and also the 7th standard class, okay. So to briefly know about the measurement means, uh, we, have to, uh, we have to learn about this in this class, okay. So the first is, uh, what we have to see about means, it's the definition of measurement. Okay, so the first what is mean by measurements means it's the base of all all in all scientific studies and experimentations. Okay, so it's the very important one. Okay, so it's the very fundamental one. Okay, um, so that. Uh, uh, they are tell uh, they are tell that what means it's the base of all scientific study okay so all scientific studies come uh, which one is the base measurement okay measurement is the basic one or the fundamental one or important one okay so measurement it plays a important role in our daily life okay and also it's the process of finding a unknown physical quantity by using a standard quantity okay so what is the definition means it's the process process okay it's the process of finding a unknown physical quantity unknown means namakku theriyadathu okay so theriyada or quantity oda or amount adu eppadi measure pandrom appadina by using a standard quantity okay standard quantities means we know length mass like that okay so it's the process of finding a unknown quantity with using by using a standard quantity okay that's why this is called as measurement okay so this one is the important of all scientific studies and experimentations okay students so the next one is what means unit systems okay what is that unit systems okay so for your perfect measurement and make a perfect on a measurement accurate on a measurement we know of Dina we need a three tools okay so the first one is what means instruments okay we have to use the which type of instruments okay and the second one is your standard quantity like length mass temperature time like that okay and the third one is an acceptable unit acceptable unit means namakka mela irukku kudiya scientists la enna panirupanga appadina sila units ellame derive panni vechirupanga adu ellame enna panirupanga appadina sila organizations vande adu accept panni vechirupanga inda inda quantity ki neenga indha da use pananum unit da for example length ku meter da mass ku kilogram da okay time second da temperature ku kelvin da appadina okay so that is an an acceptable unit okay so we have to uh, we have a yeah, perfect instruments means we need a three tools one is an instruments and third one is standard quantity uh, second one is standard quantity and the third one is an acceptable unit okay for example we have to find the length of the book means uh, here length is the standard quantity okay we have to find the length of the book means here length is the standard quantity and uh, we have to find the length means uh, which type of instruments we can use for small distance means we have to use the scales okay and the longer distance means we have to use the tape measuring tape okay so to find the length of the book means uh, which instruments we have to use scale okay simple scale we have to use okay so here uh, st standard quantity is length and the acceptable unit is a centimeter and the th um, instruments is scale okay and uh, the next one is what means some common system of units okay so these are the different system of units different types of system of units so the first one is fps system okay what is that fps system f means foot and p means pound and s means second okay so for the quantity foot okay for the quantity foot uh, the unit is what means length okay so for the length quantity we have to use the foot unit okay and for the mass quantity we have to use the pound okay and uh, this we know for the time we have to use the second okay uh, in our day to day life nama indian country la la enna use pannuvom appadina cgs abindra da use pannuvanga okay so, uh, sorry non cgs si system okay ne next class we have learn okay this one what is that means si system okay which means standard international system okay standard 
international system okay uh, this one we have to learn about the next class okay so uh, here the second system is what means a cgs system c means a centigram sorry centimeter and g means gram and s means second okay centimeter this is for length and gram this is for mass and second is for time and the third system of unit watt means mks system what is that mks m means meter and k means kilogram and s means second okay so this meter is for length or distance quantity and this kilogram is for mass or weight and this second is for time quantity okay students so these are the different types of system of units okay students thank you